Yo, look, look what else it says. It doesn't say El Mono. It says El Negro, bro. The reason why. No, saying, that's not what we have it down. So this is not El Negro, bro. This is a, another Olmec that just looks similar. Because when they was calling this one a monkey, I was over here like, nah. That's let me not find even an Olmec, though. That's yes, not an Olmec. No, it's yes, not. Yes, that is, brother. That that's that was bro. found in Mexico. That's not an Olmec. That's a monkey, bro. Depicting a monkey. No, this is not a monkey. This one is you're not saying, a monkey, bro. This is not Monument a, F. What is it? You're saying this is a this is a, a human being? Yes, this is this not is Monument saying. F. This one's not laying on the ground like y'all like y'all claim the other one is. This is a whole different one. You can see, bro. You can see the hairline. Exactly. Sorry, Mr. Sosa Bread, but I got to debunk you. This is not an Olmec artifact, and it was not found in Mexico. But I'll let Singing Bear educate you on the topic. He's touched on this very artifact years ago. Let's roll the clip. Two. Three. Yo, what's up, mi gente? Let's talk about Sanford Biggers real quick for a second. Sanford Biggers is a Harlem-based interdisciplinary artist who works in film, video, installation, sculpture, music, and performance. An LA native, he has lived and worked in New York City since 1999. Let's see his work. And here's his work. Sanford Biggers, Olmec statue and Olmec statue. Remember, we read, he is a sculpture. He made these. These are not artifacts. He had his work displayed at the Art Institute of Chicago, the museum. This is Sanford Biggers. And that's his Afro pig that he made. Let's read a little bit about it. Sanford Biggers, American born 1970. Biggers who earned his MFA from the School of the Art Institute of Chicago in 1999, was first exposed to printmaking during a trip to Japan as an undergraduate. In this print, the artist took an Afro pig in the shape of a black power salute, a popular commercial item in the 1970s, and depicted it in the style of pre-Columbian art. You see that? It's fake. Status, currently off view. It's no longer being displayed in the museum. It was taken down. It was a fake. And 20 years later, because this was literally sculptured 20 years ago, we have people using it for their debates or their um, waboism to push the narrative that this is literally an actual Omic artifact, proving that the Omics were so-called African-Americans, like this guy right here. So you see, it's just false, it's not real. So again, Singing Bear, telling everybody, bend the knee. Bullshit. For all these blue honeys, I be thumbing through yeah. this. Yeah.